Anyway, so what do we think of all of this? We were just chatting with Allison Smiley, who says she has not changed her opinion much. In fact, the more research she's done, based on that 1999 report, uh, it was a meta-analysis where you take existing research. So, I mean, here was the number that she had that she says is quite significant. Random testing, when you pull vehicles over at night, about 4% of people are under the influence of alcohol, about 8% having smoked and having THC in their system. So, on those raw numbers, people driving having smoked marijuana, at least the ones you pull over, are about double the gun drivers. But really, the only takeaway is, people have been heeding the lesson, apparently, not to drink and drive, which is good. But marijuana-impaired driving, she says, is different. And she argues that the fact people slow down so much would be a mitigating factor. In other words, it would make it a little easier. But you're still impaired. I'll join the conversation. one 332 8255 Jeremiah, what do you think when you hear about this talk and marijuana and impairment? Well, I've been smoking since grade 10, so pretty much the whole time I've been driving. And it's never really been a factor in the way I drive. I pay more attention to everything. I had my license now for four years, and my limit is 10 grams a day. So I don't know how that's going to work when they're doing nano checks or whatever. So, yeah, if I quit and I don't smoke for three or four hours before I drive, I'm still going to have over the limit. So I don't know how they're going to do that with all the people who have medical marijuana, which is lots. Like, they're handing out prescriptions left, right, and center as they're selling weed out of every second shopping mall in Regina right now. There's places to buy it and everything, so... The only problem I have with driving... Yeah. ...is I miss my turn because I'm talking too much and enjoying driving because I love driving. And, yeah, I've been pulled over, nothing, like, I... You drive normal when you're high. I don't know. They should do some more studies and actually put people behind the wheel that are high in controlled areas and see how it is. Because, yeah, I don't see anything wrong with it. Well, do you agree? She says three things. You drive generally slower, you have some delayed response time, and you might have a little bit of lane wandering. I don't agree, agree with any of that because I drive perfectly fine except missing my turn. So. And that's just because I'm talking away and distracted. I go to speed limit. I've never been into a car accident ever while I was stoned. Like, yes, when I was looking for a cigarette lighter to light a cigarette, I've rear-ended people, changing my radio, I've hit people. But I never have never been into an accident that way, ever. So, so, so tell me something. You talk about 10 grams. Is, are you a medical user up to that amount a day? Yes. Okay. Because I've been smoking since I was like 14. 
the bank. What? In RBC then. It's kind of a line I just need to withdraw 140. What is it? This false capacity. In lang. Kumusta dito? Kumusta kayo? Wala. Wala. Hindi nagsnow sa ano? Well, nagsnow ng konti sa well, it was snowing just before I left. Kagabi lang po. Kita ng Lincoln, na lalo ko siya man. Matagal. Kaya lang sila darating dito? Hindi na? Ay, 23rd. Alis na sila ng maaga. Shovel, eh. Hindi ko 
Kumawag pa ngayon yung sports eh, kung pwede siya magtrabaho o sa kayo. Ayaw yan? Marami na call in sick. Ah. So money well spent yun, yung 100 na cash ha. Pumunta kami ng uh, Juvians. Ano yung bagong restaurant? Yan. Kasama si Darrell? Ah... Hindi. Si... Ako si... Ayaw niya na mga... Punta kami na Friday. So me and Zander went. Me and Zander... Tiris siya kasi Lincoln. Punta. Si Darrell hindi siya makasama sa inyo? Hindi. Ah... May kabaw na siya na Friday. Tapos sa Sabad. Oh, what did we do? Oh, nanonood kami ng movie ni Zander. Thor. Na gusto niya. Um... Tapos... After that, nag-supper kami sa Boston Pizza, tinikot ako for my birthday. And then, sa Sunday, ginawa namin. What did you do? Ah, pumunta kami ng Jollibee. Nag-order out kami ng Jollibee. Nung mga around 10, walang hindi pala busy nun. Sunday, like around 10 o'clock or 11. And then, after that, nag-relax. Baka marami na, baka meron na yung sika. Ah, bumili siya ng puno. Yeah, yeah, stop. Yeah, then we went to the store. We bought a Christmas tree. It's free, because you buy it for $20. Then you can get a $20 redeemable bucket to use in the store. Bucket free. Ah, I don't know what that is. The session is free. $20. So the Christmas tree is not really $20. Exactly. Free lang. Plus the $20 in tree, so you get $20 ng IKEA credit. So. And then, it's a good deal. Yo, malaking ano ng Winnipeg, ng IKEA, saka yung mga Jollibee. Maraming sila ang restaurant. Ah. 7-10 pa lang dito. Terbawa semua. Masih nampi mori to, silang priority yang mana di to, kau makanan peren. Ya. Ya pers. Kalau di to, pilih tayang kuana deh lah. Ya. The stop sign is not. Drive through. I'm gonna be insane. I'll oh, just walk in. Okay. From here, you can move to Punta. So, you want to go to the If you want. You want subway, you want to subway or what? Yeah, we can eat from Butonka. Did you know? 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 Did you know?
just have a little turn. I'll do it during the summer. Yeah. Kind of home chest gonna move to. yeah. I've seen nice build ups yeah. of a banana. No, you might be well, one good thing it, it encourages you to have it clean regular. Watch me watch my man. It's so hard to work. Is that going to be clean, it's automatic? No, I don't wash them. I think I'm going to have a small chance. Doon ka sa ano? Sa dyan lang sa SE. Sa SE, so mas maganda kasi dyan sa automatic. Sa automatic, hindi mo alam kung saan ang tayo mga tubig. Hindi saan ang punta sa engine. Bakit ito hindi numerenso? Di ba ang verse yan? Bakit hindi siya tumuloy? Ito? Ay, hindi. Ulit pa lang tayo. Bili tayo ng salt kasi yung mga faucet natin nasisira na dahil walang salt, walang water salt na. Mm -hmm. Nasisira yung mga faucet kinakalawa. Oh, see. Nalagay na kaagad yun. So, we'll get the curse in some way. Dito? Yeah. 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 Could be qu good quality salt. Ano lang naman yung salt, eh. nililinis niya yung ano, kaya malaki rin yung ano natin, water bill. Nililinis niya yung softener. Yeah. Oh, ang plano. Oh. Yan yung susunod na flight na, no? kaling Winnie Winnipeg. So, walang, walang basura ngayon, di ba? Bas yeah. This week is um, recycling. Next week, next week ang basura. Payday? Wait, can I make payday mo next week or this week? I don't know. Basically, it's the same week as payday for me and mother. I don't think from payday to payday. Huh? I don't mind about the payday. Well, me knowing what the payday is doesn't really matter. Nang schedule nang basura. Pwede ka yata magano eh, mag-subscribe, i-email ka. No, no. I-email ka kung kailan darating, kailan yung schedule sa bahay. Yeah, you can do that or... Ah, Google mo lang. Pwede. Ginugol ko lang, literally. Let's be China, garbage day, pick up. I-enter mo yung, ano mo, address. Yeah, and then I'll say, kung anong postal code mo, tapos yun. May daily, may weekly schedule. Including recycling. Sa recycling, di ko lang. I think, I think it should be weekly. Kasi madami na, kasi madami na, Dapat pag Christmas, para ano nila weekly kasi marami mas walang pag Christmas. 
Oh, inaan mo ba yung ano, yung leaves mo? Sa busura? What? In, kasi bago ko malis, meron pa tayong space para sa busura. Eh, wala pa. Pag, pag bahay no, no, like, did you put like leaves? Yeah. Uh. There are two of them. I always put them. We spoke a few minutes to go and we had such feedback. I wanted to take on this. Is it a good thing? Is it a Yeah. Oh, so it's a little bit of 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 a little b